Hey guys, it is Britain. I'm back with another video. Today, um, as you guys can tell by the title, I will be doing a wig transformation from this cosplay wig that I got off of Amazon and it's really really cheap and I wanted to transform it into something cuter something more wearable less shiny that looks more realistic it is 12 in the morning so if I'm like sound a little lower it's because my mom is sleeping in the other room and I don't want her to hear me and then you know you know how moms can be but yeah, it's late at night. I decided to film this because I'm not going to feel like filming it tomorrow. Um, well, tomorrow is the, this is a Saturday, but whatever. Um, yeah. Um, if you want more content, ooh, cool content. What the hell? If you want more content, Please subscribe, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you know when I post new videos. Join the family, y'all. The subscription is free. Everyone is welcome. Once again, it doesn't matter what your color, okay, your race, um, your religion, your sex, your sexuality. It doesn't matter. You're all welcome. Join the family. Join the family. Also, don't forget to add me on social media. Add me on my Instagram. It will be over here somewhere add me on instagram we let over there my Insta my instagram stories be popping okay okay if you want to see this wig get transformed just keep on watching all right so this is a wig it's such a pretty color too so i've got i got this wig off of amazon and i received it two days ago amazon prime honey and this is the wig right here i'll put a picture up so you can see like how it looked when i bought it and i was like looking for some wigs because i you know i love color i always dye my hair and stuff and i wanted some wigs that have color and stuff that i'm afraid to try on my own head um and this is one of the colors it's like a nice hot pink which i thought was super cute and I also have another color wig that I that's coming in the mail. I'm just waiting for it. But this wig, I wanted to get this. This wig was like 12 bucks or something like that. I forgot the price of it. But it's like a cosplay wig, like um, one of them anime character wigs. Which I don't have an issue. I love cosplaying. But I actually want to transform this into something else like something cuter let me put this on so they have the clips this is what it looks like on the inside they have the clips i added the clips because so it could be more secure on my head it won't slip off so let me put this on real quick Ouch. damn it i forgot i have a big ass head so So this is how the wig looks. <laughs> the bang is very long and I understand why they make the bangs long for cosplay. It's because um, it's better to make them longer than um, like having them short and stuff because people have different size heads so like it's good that they make them long so you can like adjust the size the length or of how long you want your bangs and stuff. I really like that. Um, this is a once again a synthetic wig i'm just using one of the combs that i got for my other wigs um because i can't find my rat my fish my rat tail comb so this works pretty good too it doesn't really knot up like that because i got another wig that knots up really bad but this one doesn't knot up as bad see that shine y'all no nah, this is not how it's supposed to be like you see that shine y'all oh no oh no 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 so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna first part this real quick so i can see all right there i go i look weird right now it's okay 
I'm gonna make me look cute in this wig. Don't worry about it. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to basically cut. It's not even all that straight yet, so I can really cut and see. Cause I was like, if I wet it, it will be so much better for me to um, cut it. But whatever, we're gonna do this, I don't have time. So basically I want this a little shorter than how it is. I probably want it like more up to here a little bit, maybe a little lower. So what I'm gonna do is I'm parting my hair. I'm gonna take some rubber bands and I'm gonna kind of sort of place them where I want them. So that height is about right as good as it's gonna get I am pulling it down a little longer than how I want it because just in case of mistakes you know when I was gonna be perfect so I'm just gonna take this and I'm going to cut a little lower and now I'm just going to cut through the hair no Bruh, I'm so mad because this stupid rubber band, I cut through the rubber band by accident and I'm like pretty mad. Damn it. It's okay, I'll fix it. So that's how it looks. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. I feel like this is very um, not good at all. I feel like I'm a Sophia Nygaard video all over again let's go this came out better so that's how the wig looks okay and I know it looks crazy but we're gonna fix it okay what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the bangs because okay this is when it's gonna be time to like really fix this okay so now I'm doing the bangs hopefully I can see it and I hate the fact that the bangs are low-key curled I'm just gonna take this the bangs that are like here I think I'm gonna leave these like side part these side bangs the longer pieces to the edge so I'm basically, now I'm just going to take something to tie my hair back while I do this bang. See how this turns out. Pray for me, y'all. Okay, so I'm going to pit it over my face. And basically, I'm just going to take it in sections. I'm going to take a section. I'm going to take this part. And basically, I'm going to, not going to do, I'm not going to do a blunt cut. I'm just going to, I don't know what you call them, I'm not a hairstylist, but I'm gonna cut it like this, cause I feel like that makes it look more natural. Okay, not bad, not bad, not bad. So now I'm just going to take more of the bang and I'm just going to do the same thing and hope for the best that it comes out how I want it. Okay, now it's time to fix this damn bang. Okay, first things first. This, this is horrendous. You see this cut? You see how bad this cut is? I feel like if I just kinda make the, I don't know. 
What the hell? I can fix it when I am doing everything else. So now that I have this, let me go get my head so I can like make more bone cuts. Cause I wanted to do it on my on my own head first so I can see like where I want it short and stuff. But if I do this on my head and then fix it on another head, it I think it would, it would turn out better. So let me go get my head. All right, so on this part, um, as you see, I put my put the hair on a mannequin head, and it is it is a little wet, and um, I was trying to film this part of me styling and cutting and trimming the ends, but it just the the situation with the camera and the angle was very uncomfortable, so I filmed this little bit, but I stopped. So I just wanted to show you guys this part so you can see that I was actually trying to film this part and show you guys me show you guys me trying to trim the ends and stuff like that. But it just wasn't working out with the filming situation. So yeah, on to the next part. I'm back. I know I look like um, the girl from the Sia video, but it's coming along better than how it was going before. So, um, what I did was I put it on a mannequin and I wet it a little bit so it could straighten, but that didn't work at all. So, what I did was I took my flat iron and I put it on the lowest settings. Um, and I straightened the whole wig and I cut some of it. I still have some more trimming and better evening evening to do, but it's coming out pretty good. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to work on my bangs right now so I can thin those out and then I'll work on the rest of my hair. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my bangs, the other pieces of hair, and I'm going to put this back. And much needed but I know the hair is short so it's I have to put in a really tight ponytail because the hair is is short so I'm gonna do that and then now I'm just going to focus more on my bangs so what I'm gonna do I finally found my rat tail comb so what I was going to do is I was going to now and now that I have better scissors um, what I was going to do is I was going to take some more on the inner parts and I'm going to trim that. So I'm like going from the inside to the out. So I'm just going to like take from the bottom of here. Like, you know, something like that and kind of trim it out a little bit. After this, I'm going to show you guys how to get rid of the shininess because even though we can get this wig looking popping, like we still gotta work on the shininess because this shininess ain't doing it, sis. feel like the bang is thinner than how it was before so if I do need to do some more tweaking I will do that but now what I'm gonna do is I'm about, about to take this shine out and then I'm going to bump it and style it so how I learned to take um, shine out of wigs is using either fabric softener but some people said that doesn't really work or baby powder but i don't have baby powder i have setting powder so that's what i'm going to use i'm going to use my setting powder it's damn near the closest thing to translucent so i'm just going to what they did was they put baby powder on the wig and then brushed it through or combed it through. So that's what I'm gonna do. I know it looks crazy right now, but 
I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. It's okay. Mm, it didn't really get a lot of the shine out. I could see how in some places it did not. So I'm gonna kind of bump this a little bit. Put it on the lowest setting. And I'm gonna bump this a little bit. Trying to give it a little bit more uh, whatever. Damn, I really tried to bump it. It's not bumping. Yeah, it's not bumping. It's not doing what I want it to do. shine come back anyway after that look at that shine damn it i thought i could do something with it i'm struggling here like it's like i like the color i like the length it's just the fact that I just can't seem to bump it and make it look better than it actually does right here. Cause this has potential, but I just can't seem to get it. Okay, maybe, let's see. Okay, let's see. Hmm, all right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually put some rollers in it, like the Hold on, I'm gonna show you. So I kinda like the way it looks, so I'm not gonna bump a lot of it a lot. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these things and I'm going to just bump the, the bang a little bit and maybe a little bit of over here, but um, I'm not gonna do much. So I'm gonna put this on my wig cap, on my head, on my foam head, and then I'm gonna roll it up and then in a couple of hours, cause it's one o'clock in the morning, um, I'm going to see if this bumped anymore because my bang is not bumping at all. So, um, yeah, pray for me. Pray that this works. All right, y'all. So this is what I look like so far. I'm going to do the rest of the back also. And then I'm also going to do the bang. And then after that, um, I'm going to sleep. And I'll see you guys in like uh, in a few hours or so. Um, obviously I'm gonna cut you to the next scene, but this is what it looks like. I really like the color. I really want this to work, so hopefully next time when you see me, this will work. All right, so it is around like 1.30 in the afternoon. Um, so here's the hair, here's where we left off. I'm gonna put it on and I'm gonna see what I could do. I have my flat iron here just in case I can um, do something with it, but let, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. Hold on, let me let me make the clips on one another. Bam! Okay, it's on. It looks a mess. Go back. Come on here. All right. So. Oh shit, my lights, oops. Oh, we have the bangs. So I'm gonna see how these curls, please, at least like bump just a little bit. I really hope it did. Oh, it did! Okay, wait a minute. Maybe I got, I got something going on here a little bit. Okay, it's a little wavy. 
It's a little wavy. It's a little wavy. I don't know if I could, I'll be able to. Maybe I should have left it straight. I don't know if this going to go great. It's not coming out how, how, how high I want it, but let's see if this, if I can make it work. You're going to use a brush this time. I know the back needs to be did, so don't come for me. Let's see how this looks. Gosh, damn. Why'd I do that? I'm trying to see how I look. Now it looks like a freaking fake ass, party city ass wig. I'm trying to look in my mirror over here to see how I will rock it. Oh, it's low key cute, kind of, sort of, kind of, sort of cute. What y'all think? I think this is the best I'm gonna get. Like, if I play with it more, I don't want this video to be too long. I know the back is not as curled because I didn't do it. I'm gonna try and bump it just a little bit. It's like flat in the back, but up here it's giving me life. I still feel like my bang is a little thick. I'm gonna play with it more, but I feel like this looks a little better than how it did when it first came off the package. What do y'all think? So what do y'all think? I feel like I toned down the shine just a little bit from how it was. The length is cute, but I feel like I could do so much more with the bangs. Maybe, let me um see if I could like thin out the bangs just a little bit more, cause um, I feel like they're a little too thick for me. So let me see if I can um, thin them out just a little bit. And my Chipotle's here. I'm hungry, so I'm going to try and do whatever I can to help my hair right now. Because I don't know, sis. I don't know. Alright, this is as good as it's going to get, I feel like. So, I mean, it's kind of sort of cute. So, I don't know. I think it's kind of sort of cute. I'd rock it like this a little bit. I do want it to get, so, I didn't get the shine all the way out. It is mounted down a little bit since I put the powder in my hair. Um, if you want it more, I'm going to go out later and get some dry shampoo because i heard dry shampoo really helps get rid of shine um so um i'm going to go and get that later today but right now it's gonna have to do i would actually wear it like this i'm i don't know the more i'm looking at it the better it gets so i don't know i kind of like it I could do more to it, more to the bangs. The big, the bangs have thinned out more than it was before, but I think I'm gonna do more tampering with that, and I'm going to get these curls and stuff under control. Other than that, I kind of like it. So, what do you guys think? Do you guys like it? This is low key cute. I ain't even gonna lie. I ain't even gonna lie. I ain't even gonna lie. This is low-key cute. Okay, Brittany, who do you think you are, sis? All right, that is it for this video. I hope you guys like this. Um, let me know how you think down in the comments, how you think this turned out. Um, for anybody that can give a few pointers, because I'm still new at this wig transformation type of stuff. So if you can give me some pointers something to do like comment that down below i'm open to any feedback um like this video if you do want more with transformation videos and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you know when i post new videos and don't forget
don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Let me, let me, let me just move over. It's right here. It's right here. It's, it's right here. Just like you, you'll see, you'll see how my page looks. Okay. It's, it's right here, sis. It's, it's right here. It's right here. I post a lot. Uh, subscribe. I mean, follow, follow me. I, I mean, everyone's welcome. Everyone's welcome. I don't, I don't discriminate. Everyone's welcome. I, just, just follow me and subscribe to this channel. Everyone's welcome. I'm always lit on my Instagram. I'm always posting on stories. I post many tutorials. And also, if you watch my stories, you'll see a little sneak peeks of what I'm doing on Instagram, of what next videos may be coming out. Um, I do a lot of polls on there, so you can so you guys have a say and i like to hear feedback from you guys so follow me on instagram girl follow me on instagram y'all yeah once again subscribe hit that notification bell and i'll see you guys in my next video bye